is going on family how y'all doing this ain't the ordinary videos i usually put up you know but i want to get this off my mind right now i want to talk about the um sonia massey incident the killing the killing but if y'all if y'all don't know what's going on sonia uh massey she was um a black she's a black woman she was a black woman until they killed her and she they got a call the police got a call that somebody was breaking into her car and when they went to the house her house they seen of course that the glass of the window was broken uh the car window and they went to talk to her and um you know normal everything was normal the video they this is the, this is the body cam footage of the police they released the video like you know so Everything was normal. I was talking to her, and you know, back it had a little back and forth. You know, normal, you know, normal stuff. And she said, "I think I remember." She said, "I rebuke you in the name of Jesus." You know, how, you know, like our moms used to say, my mom used to say, my grandma used to say stuff like that. And with the with the quickness, they just pulled out their guns. She had a, a she had a a, um, a pot of water. You know, I don't know if she was cooking something more, but she had a pot of water and she was moving it around. And they just pulled their guns out. They just pulled their guns out. And, you know, and she ducked. She went, you know, of course, in, in the instinct, she ducked and tried to duck from it. And, and and they shot her. And one of the policemen was saying that they shot her in the head and killed her. And, you know, when are we going to wake up, y'all? I'm getting, I'm getting tired of being a statistic. I'm getting tired of us being statistics. I'm getting tired of people making excuses. Going back to the George Floyd. Going back to George Floyd. He was a he was a criminal. He just that. Like I'm I'm tired of us. I'm tired of people trying to make us criminals, and killing us in the worst ways. Making it making it normal to kill us. Cause that's what it is. It's normal to kill us. Every time you see us on something, it's normal to kill us. When somebody else get killed or hurt, oh, this a, oh my God! But with us, it's like, well, that's how we are. No, it's not. You know what I'm saying? It's not. She was an innocent victim, and they murdered her. They gunned her down in her home for no reason. No, what she said was, "I rebuke you in the name of Jesus." If them police officers don't get punishment, like like most, and we, you know, you know what pissed me off too, what makes me mad is that. There's people out there always saying, there, oh, there's good police officers, there's good police officers. Yes, there's good police officers. Stop saying that. Stop saying that. Because where are they when we need them? That's the thing. Where where are they at? Where are they at when we need them? Where was he? Where was the good the police officer in that moment saying, wait, 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 what are you doing? Where was he at then? Uh, she's, a, she's a woman. She ain't, there's no weapon. There's no nothing. What are you, what are y'all doing? It's too many of there's too many of these police officers too who are, are gun ho, gun ho ready to pull out, shoot anything that was cowboy shit like this ain't this ain't the western this ain't cowboy stuff man, you hurt you this is people's lives and, and you dealing and issues man, you don't know how to control yourself and hold and hold your gun you never shot before, or you you know what I'm saying because you want to just pull it out. You know, the, 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 we, we say them high school guys, they, they were weak in high school, so now they want to be police officers, they want to be big and bad and show off. and You know what I'm saying? Like, that that's not it. Because certain other, other countries, they, they don't use guns all the time. They don't even have the guns on them, certain countries. But you know how America is. You know, we gun, like I said, we gun ho. We just shoot first and ask questions later. Now it's to the point, now it's to the point where we have to carry guns. The, 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 re the regular people have to carry guns. To protect ourselves. We shouldn't have to protect ourselves from the police. But that's a whole other story. Because police the police were made during slavery anyway. So that, so that dynamic still would never change. Even we try to go to the good side of things. But when your foundation is still... You know what I'm saying? I'm, uh, the dark, I'm trying to make a Dark Knight reference. Um... Because I remember when in the movie Dark Knight, you remember the movie Dark Knight Rises with Bane, Batman, and everything looked good from the from a point of view, from a top layer. But in the bottom, it was things is going on, bad guys is 
doing certain things. So at the end, it over flooded and all the criminals was broke free, escaped. So people get thrown out their homes. So that's what I'm saying. Like, it, like I said, the police, these police need punishment. They need to be, they need, they need to go to jail. You know, they need to go to jail. You know what I'm saying? George Floyd was definitely a wake up call for people, but more things is constantly things like this keeps happening. So, so we really need some kind of ain't, ain't keep on funding police, giving police more money for things. No, we don't need that. We need them to. We need accountability. We need accountability for these people. You know, and that's what it is. It's like it's like it seemed like the cameras now. The f camera footage on the cops don't do nothing no more. Don't really even really do nothing. We seeing we seeing these things on the on the footage, and it's like, then what? They gonna get transferred? They gonna they gonna they gonna fire them, and, and they gonna get transferred somewhere else? I, it's crazy, y'all. I'm trying to get my thoughts together. I should have got my thoughts together before video, but you know I was just a little frustrated. And, um, you know, I know y'all frustrated too, dealing with this, like everybody, but it's, it's just insane that we keep doing the same infinite repeat, repeat scenario and nothing's, ch nothing's really changed, you know, as a, a and like I said, if, if it's not, it, it to, to other people, to other cultures, to, to them, we just, we just nothing, you know, it's, it's deeper. It's more than that, man. Like they, like, like I said, the cops always mess with us, always killed us, always treat us bad. This country always treated us bad. And the police was, was to put, keep us in line, you know, I guess I went back to slavery times. Like I said, cause the police went back to slavery times too. Like I said, it, everything, everything is a repeat. And like I said, they, they need we need accountability. We they need to be locked up. And that family is hurt and broken about their daughter. This is, she's a daughter. She was a daughter. I'm not sure if she. I don't know if she had kids or she was a mother. Uh, she, I know she was a daughter. And the, the dad, the, the the father of her of 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 Sonia Massey. He said that he didn't know that it was police. He thought it was, they told him, uh, he thought it was a criminal that did that. So he lied to him at that. You know, I might make another video about this. I don't know, I'm not sure. Right now I'm kind of like, you know, a little fluttered. But um, leave, leave a comment. Let me know how you feel. Talk, talk to me about this. It's third party. All right, peace.